Well, a trio of men stand charged in the murder of a two-year-old girl, Mackenzie Oldham, an innocent child caught in the crossfire of a chaotic street fight. A district judge hearing testimony today to determine if there's enough evidence to stand trial. Guy Gordon joins us now. He's at Frank Murphy. And Guy, we heard today what set off this whole chain of events. And Carmen, when you hear it, it is so infuriating. This started off as a pre-prom celebration, uh, but the girl that was dressed up in all of her prom finery got into a dispute with her sister's boyfriend. She threw milk and hot sauce on him. He threw Kool-Aid on her and her prom dress, and it all blew up. So yes, literally, this little two-year-old died over spilled milk. I told him he was wrong for spilling the drink on my sister. Michelle Jenkins testifying her boyfriend Antoine's brother came out and faced down a crowd of more than a dozen. Cleveland came outside and said, who want to fight my brother Antoine? A brawl ensued. A cousin threw Antoine Smelly to the ground, leaving him unconscious. His brother Cleveland involved in a bloody brawl with another man. Cleveland Smelly ran around the car and when I turned around, I seen the first shot shoot. When he shot the first shot, who shot the first shot? Cleveland Smelly. I fell on the ground. It felt like a flash went right past my ear. And then that's when I'm like, and that's when we just, he just pulled off. Crosby was in the car with her four-year-old nephew and little Mackenzie Oldham. And then all, that, all I heard was my nephew say, he shot her, he shot her. Cross-examination suggests the alleged shooter's attorney may claim that he acted in self-defense. Who was winning the fight? You remember telling the police officer that uh, your cousin was getting the best of Cleveland. Is that correct? Yes. All right. That he was taking a vicious beating, and that's why he pulled a gun, never intending to hit McKenzie. Uh, that could be the narrative that we'll hear from the defense here. But three men on trial here, or will determine if they go to trial. Uh, we've got Antoine Smelly. He was the one that possessed the gun. Devonte Bennett, he's the one that gave the gun to Cleveland Smelly, according to testimony today, and that was Cleveland Smelly that was shooter. Three men, all three charged with first-degree murder, assault with intent to murder, and felony firearm. This resumes next Wednesday. We're live from the Frank Murphy Hall of Justice. I'm Guy Gordon, Local 4.